A lot of women want to know when they're ovulating, and the best thing you can do is start tracking your cycles. Normal cycles are 25 to 35 days in length, that is 25 to 35 days from the beginning of one period to the beginning of the next period. And ovulation usually happens sometime mid-cycle or 12 to 16 days before your next period is going to begin. Some women ovulate a little bit earlier than the norm and some a little bit later. If you're trying to have a baby and time things just right, you have to time intercourse with ovulation. And if you're just starting the process, the best thing to do is to start having intercourse on the day your period ends and have intercourse every other day for about 7 to 14 days, depending on how long your cycles are. The longer the cycle, the longer you should continue with it. And this should help to time things just right. Now, if you've been trying for a couple of months to have a baby, or you just want to know when you're ovulating, you're not exactly sure, there are a few things you can do to pay closer attention and to hone in more closely on when your body is ovulating. Because like I mentioned before, it's not a perfect science. You can pay close attention to cervical mucus, and there will be a change in it around the time of ovulation. It becomes more slippery and more clear. So if you notice that, then you're probably around the time of ovulation. You can also take your basal body temperature each morning before you get out of bed, before you go pee, before you drink anything or eat anything, take your temperature. And you'll probably notice about a 0.5 degree Fahrenheit increase um, the day after you ovulate. And this increase in temperature continues until your next period begins. Now, this helps you in retrospect if you're trying to get pregnant. Obviously, if you've already ovulated, you missed your opportunity for that month. But that helps you if you're doing it from month to month to know exactly when your body's ovulating. And you can notice trends and try to time things just right. Many women also use ovulation prediction kits, and this is detecting a surge in LH hormone in your body, which is associated with ovulation. So these are all ways that you can um, track your cycles more closely and find out when you're ovulating. If you don't think that you're ovulating or you have very irregular cycles, talk with your doctor and they can ask you more specific questions, perform an exam, and decide if further investigation is warranted. If you have any other questions in the future for me, please feel free to ask them on our Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash intermountainmoms and recommend us to your friends and family too.